Yeah, hello everyone, Clinton here. Welcome to the channel. If you're joining us for the first time, I really do appreciate you and I'm here to tell you you're welcome. Alright guys, so in this video, I'm going to be um, telling you guys about this Binance feature called the Binance Pay. So guys, what is Binance Pay? Binance Pay is a user-to-user -user crypto uh, payment gateway that Binance uh, has provided for their user to be able to send crypto um, um, to and fro or back and forth uh, using the different accounts or uh, making use of the pay ID that they have provided. This service is absolutely free and there is no charge for you to be able to use it. And one very good thing about it is that you don't have to wait for any confirmation unlike transferring with normal regular uh, network. Okay guys, so without wasting much time, let's go into this um, short and brief tutorial. Just in case of uh, you guys don't know yet, uh, if ever you don't have a Binance account yet or this is your first time, you can actually check on the link down below to be able to register for your free account and you can be able to follow up with this um, short and brief tutorial. So I'm going to be talking about how you can be able to carry this action in your in the website and also in your mobile um, device. Uh, I'm going to proceed first of all with the um, website because it's kind of more um, confusing uh, at first glance. So um, all you have to do now is just to come over to the Binance website after you've created your account and you can actually just uh, start following up with the tutorial with me. Okay, so what next here is going to be how can we use the Binance Pay? So for you to be able to use the Binance Pay, you have to set up your Binance Pay account. And another thing you have to uh, uh, understand is that before you can be able to use the Binance Pay, you have to be at least be a and you have to verify your account just for the first level, which is the ID, um, the KYC, the identification verification. So once you're done with that part, you can actually then be able to use this feature of Binance Pay. So Binance Pay and how can we make by our payment with Binance Pay? We can actually make payments with Binance Pay using um, different web method. Uh, if you're if you're actually using your mobile phone, there is a feature that you can. I'm gonna be showing you the guys in that in a very few uh, minutes from now. You can actually scan someone's um, Binance Pay ID. Uh, it's gonna be in form of a barcode. You can actually scan it and pay so that you actually know that you are sending it to the right person. Okay guys, one thing you have to note is that any payment that is being made with Binance Pay, it is not reversible and you should actually cross check any um, Binance Pay ID that you're going to be using to send. You can actually send payments with the email, with the Binance Pay ID, with the user uh, ID and you can also use the mobile number. Pay ID is totally different from user ID. Okay guys. I'm going to go into this tutorial now and show you guys everything you have to know here. Okay, from our screen here now, you can see that we're in the um, official website. Make sure you are in the official website, guys. Please don't go to something different. Okay, now we are here. Uh, all you have to do is to, like I said in the first time, you have to set up your um, account. Come over to this part that says overview. Once you click on overview, you go down to the section that says um, funding. Once you go down to funding, you can see this option that says buy, sell, pay and gift card. You're going to choose this part that says pay. If you are new to the Binance Pay, once you click on pay, they're going to show you a, a few steps to follow up to create your account. It doesn't take less than a minute for you to create your account there. And once you've created your account, this is going to be your pay ID. And once you get your pay ID, you, uh, during the process, you are, you, you're going to choose your, your, your name that you want to use there. And it doesn't actually have to be your real name or stuff like that. Okay, guys. So, um, I'm going to tell you guys, uh, something that's very, very important here. Um, if you are sending, um, uh, payments, you have to make sure that you are sending it with the pay ID. That's what I actually prefer because Sometimes some people account, they have not activated the email and mobile number. So be sure you are sending it to um, the person's pay ID directly. Pay ID is different from um, user ID. I'm going to show you that in, in a very short time now. Okay, so what you have to know is that if you want to send payment, uh, you can actually click on send and receive. All right, so there is a setting here that says uh, um, pin during your during uh, setting up of your account they're going to tell you that you should choose a pin and once you choose a pin 
do not forget that pin because that is what you're going to be using to actually make all your payment if you forget that pin don't panic you can actually go ahead and come over to this place that says forget pay pin and you can follow the procedure i don't know what it's going to look like but it might not be something you want to start to do so for the safety of your account do not forget your uh, pay pin very important okay once you're done with that part you can actually go over to this part that says uh send receive once you click on send it's going to take you over to uh this part is going to ask you to put the email the mobile number the pay id you can see pay id can be found on the receivers page and the binance id which is the user id can be found in the user's dashboard under user id that is under this part that under this logo on my account here you can see this logo here okay so that's where you can find your um binance id but preferably use your pay id and you can actually come and click on this common payees to so people that you have actually been sending uh payments to they will actually be on this part so that you can actually just go back it's just like a beneficiary so once you've gone once you're done with that you can actually just put a pay id i'll just paste my pay id and click on continue and once i click on continue i'm going to choose the currency that i want to send you can actually choose whatsoever currency you are interested in using and once i'm done click on the amount you can just put um a positive number one usdt doesn't matter and you click on continue once you click on continue um it's going to ask you for your uh, pay pin but because i'm using i'm sending it to myself this is what i'm going to get payment to your own in the wallet is not supported okay fine so guys that's just everything you have to know about that so guys i'm going to take you guys on the step on how to um follow up with this tutorial on your phone okay so once we are in our mobile phone right now um all you have to do is to um don't forget there's a link in the description you can able to use that link to create your account for free and you can actually uh get some free tokens uh it's called like the referral um for new users you can actually get the opportunity to get free um busd or stuff like that so once you have you have um, created your account you open your account go over to here that says wallet and you can actually go over to this place that says uh pay the same step if you're a new user they're going to show you um steps on how to create your account less than a minute and you're done so once you're once you're done um with with that step you can actually come over to this part and you will see this um, um you can see this on your screen and you can actually click on send or click on receive or you can actually just scan someone's qr code to get qr code you have to um, you have to click on receive i'm going to click on receive now on on my um system and as you can see now there's a qr code there i can select the currency uh i can choose bnb i can choose one bnb and now we have one bnb i will confirm that and if i scan this with my phone right now automatically it's going to tell me that i am going to be making payment one bnb all i have to do is to click on continue so when I click, once i click on continue i don't have that uh fund in my account now and aha uh -huh, there's something i have to tell you guys um for the um binance pay each each payment is going to actually be coming from um coming from your funding wallet so guys if ever you um if ever you you let's say for instance i'm just gonna paste my id here and this is gonna be coming from your um funding funding account if ever you find out that um is telling you that you don't have a sufficient fund but you are sure that you have fund in your wallet try and go over to this part and try to go over to the overview and once you're in the overview Come over to this part that says um uh, i guess transfer yeah transfer then you can just transfer maybe your 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 balance would be in uh, fiat and spot just click on this uh stuff here and once you once you transfer that you can just click on transfer and you can choose within from from which account or and to which account you want to send it if you're using a mobile phone you can actually just go back and follow the same step click on transfer and automatically it's going to show you um transfer from your spots to funding or funding to spots you can actually choose which currency you want to send and that's basically everything you have to know then you click on the amount and you click on uh, confirm transfer once you're done with that 
once you're done with that your your balance will be in your funding account and you can actually then carry out with your transaction all right guys this is basically everything you need to know about binance pay it's easy it's fast and it doesn't have any fee okay guys if you find this video really uh, helpful uh don't forget to uh give the video a like drop a comment i really do appreciate that and you can consider doing subscribing to the channel i really do appreciate that you're supporting the channel and i really appreciate all our subscribers we have on to this point all right guys see you guys on the next one have a nice day